Utsaha is an essential factor in matters governing human thoughts and actions, and directs all human achievements because primarily it is the strength of will, firmness of resolve, energy and power, endurance and perseverance, and the joy and elation resulting from achievement of pre-determined objectives. Meaning Utsaha Sanskrit, Utsaha means enthusiasm, zeal, energy, strength, power, fortitude, strength of will, resolution, firmness, effort, endurance, perseverance, cheerfulness, joy, happiness, it also means initiative or drive. As psychical essential Sridharswami regards joy as the energy utsaha of the mind due to the attainment of cherished objects or the union with a beloved person, in other words, utsaha is a mode of essence of the mind, it is an essential psychical element in a violation, which precedes a voluntary action. Therefore, Madhusudana describes it as a resolution of the mind. Utsaha or enthusiasm is roused in superior persons by the absence of sadness, this dominant state rouses the vira rasa or the emotion of heroism, and by rousing utsaha, jadeda or stupor and nidra or sleep caused by physiological action, is inhibited. As emotional essential Bharata, the legendary author of Natyashastra, speaks about the nine primary emotions by which rasa, the primary sentiment that appeals to poetic sensibility, is nourished, they are, rati enjoyment, hasya mirth, soka grief, krata anger, utsaha enthusiasm, bhaya fear, jugyapsa disgust, vismaya surprise, and sama or santa peace, based respectively on nine navarasas primary sentiment. Utsaha or energy relates to persons of the superior types, and this sentiment is caused by determinants such as absence of sadness, power, patience, heroism and the like, and is represented on the stage by consequence such as steadiness, munificence, boldness of an undertaking and the like. As divine essential According to Abhinavagupta the Rasas are like gods, and Santa is like their highest center, Shiva, he insists on transcendence as the highest value in literary aesthetics. Bharata does not consider complete detachment, nirveda world weariness as the saint Hayabhava of Santa because detachment ordinarily does not arise from knowledge of the truth. Ishvara Krishna states that from detachment comes only prakritalaya i.e. the dissolution of the eight causes, and not moksha, and Patanjali states that from knowledge of truth arises aversion to the gunas detachment, which is really the highest state kastha of knowledge. Atman alone, possessed of pure qualities such as knowledge, bliss etc., and devoid of enjoyment of imagined sense objects, is the saint Hayabhava of Santa. Santa is Sama and Sama is the true nature of the self. Energy may be said to be based on egoism as its essence, and Santa may be said to consist in the loosening of egoism, but there is no state that is devoid of utsaha energy. Utsaha or dynamic energy is the Saint Hayabhava or primary state of Vira Rasa, without Utsaha one cannot act. Natya Sastra v.66 tells us that Vira Rasa is a dynamic energy utsaha which arises from various causal factors such as decisiveness, not giving way to depression, not being surprised or confused. As rational essential A ruler is supposed to possess and the means of gaining three kinds of shakti powers viz., the powers of mantra counsel, prabhutva command over material resources and utsaha energy. 
Yudhishthira considered counsel as being superior to the command over material resources and dignity, and Chanakya puts Utsaha in the lowest position among these three powers. Utsaha also refers to heroic energy or effort. Resolve is the root of king's righteousness, he who is strong on resolve rules over those strong on words. Mahabharata 12.58.13-15, and Utsaha is one's resolve. The Vedic king was not regarded as the lord of the earth but the lord of men Rig Veda IV.38.2 or cattle Go Paddy Rig Veda V.28.3. It is at the time of the epics that territorial rights had assumed a dominant role. Topic as realistic essential. Bhagavad Gita 18.26 refers to Utsaha as the untiring self-application and dynamic enthusiasm for achieving a chosen goal. Krishna tells Arjuna that one who performs his duty without association with the modes of material nature, without false ego, with great determination and enthusiasm, dhartutsahasamanvita without wavering in success or failure is said to be a worker in the mode of goodness, this means that such a person is always enthusiastic till the completion of such work. Ramana uses the word, urine to refer to the strength of will, self-control or knowledge or to mean specifically strength of conviction to know oneself. As working instrument in yoga Aurobindo recalls to mind the combined working of the four great instruments of yoga for gaining yoga siddhi or perfection in yoga, viz., sastra i.e. the knowledge of truths, principles, powers and processes that govern self-realization, utsaha, the patient and the persistent action on the force of personal effort on the lines laid down by knowledge, guru or teacher and kala the instrumentality of time. Utsaha is a mental spirit which leads to promptness in every action. But, in Amerikosha it occurs as a synonym of Ajavasaya meaning buddy or intelligence, and Matakshara explains Ajavasaya or Utsaha Purasarthasadana Karmarambojavasaya as the effort or perseverance in the performance of acts accomplishing the objects of man. In the context of Spandakarika street, 15, which states that only the effort directed towards the product of action disappears here in states of intense introverted contemplation, it has been explained that, "...the product of action," is the created object of perception, the "...effort directed towards it," is the exertion or utsaha inherent in the agency of the self. <laughs> 